Hi all, welcome to the Team of the Week 3 predictions. This is up super early compared to usual. I was actually even going to get this up last night, but I kind of wanted to wait till the a couple of the late night games were finished, but hopefully you still find this very useful regardless. Smash the likes are always sub to the channel if you're new, follow me on Twitter, G is a legend, all the links are down below for posting the channel and social media links as always. Then have a great week in predictions for Team of the Week 2, but some nice cards to potentially look forward to and definitely one that I'm hoping to try out. But Rufier, Six saves and a clean sheet, very, very impressive for St Etienne against Monaco, who aren't performing very well this season, Monaco. But um, St Etienne keeping a clean sheet there, and Rufier stands out. Maguire, one goal and a clean sheet for Leicester, absolute ruthless from Harry Maguire, clinical in every department for what I saw of the game, and deserves his inform. Trippier, one goal and a clean sheet. Kane got two goals, but for me, due to the lack of standout defenders, Trippier, for me, will get the nod and would be quite a nice cheap alternative, I hope, at right back, time will tell, but again one goal, if he'd kept a clean sheet I think he would be given a nod, but um, due to, as I said, the lack of standout defenders, I think he might just get the nod. Forgan Hazard, one goal, one assist, for Borussia Watch and Gladbach, um, as I said, mids are tight this week to determine, and I think he might just get given the nod. Gliffy Sigurdsson, two goals, he missed a penalty to get the hat-trick, if he'd got the, the penalty, then I think he'd be a given, but two goals regardless. Um, but keep your eyes peeled for him. Um, I really think he will still get in for Team of the Week. And over to Royce, who played at Cam. He got two goals and two assists. Um, 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 sorry, two goals and one assist, and then he got an assist in another game. But the two goals and one assist is what the main focus is and should get in. Sterling, absolutely ruthless as well, with one goal, one assist. Also, in line for Player of the Month as well, so keep in mind if he does get an in for him. A player of the month card would be an incredibly big boost on top of that as well. Then Neymar played centre forward for PSG and got himself two goals. Um, Cavani played equally well, and I've seen a few folk predict him, but for me, Neymar is the one that I am opting for, and I feel he will get given the first and foremost. Might be we'll waiting for a hat trick, but I think he will get one regardless. Ibrahimovic got two goals. He was on course for a hat trick, but Alessandrini took the penalty. And despite that, I still feel Ibra will get given his first in form of potentially many um, for FIFA 19, but um, ruthless in the MLS is Ibra. And Zukic, two goals for Juventus. Um, Ronaldo got two assists, but I can't see them doing two assists for Ronaldo. They're going to wait for something big for him, it, it, despite him obviously having a one to watch. But strong start 11. Neto, six saves on clean sheet. One of them being a penalty save, which should really stand in his favour immensely and goalkeepers this week could be very very impressive and that is something you can rarely say for a team of the week actually it's sometimes not always the best Gallo one goal and a clean sheet for AK Athens I was kind of I felt like I've caught some straws a little bit here I've seen folk go with Crescito but I've just went with Gallo he is a bit of a punt um, David Gray one goal and a clean sheet for Hibs this is kind of my bias pick um, defenders for what I saw didn't do much this week but Gray was just very impressive he nearly got um, two assists in the game, even though it was only 1-0. Um, uh, Danny Rose of Mansfield, two goals, two assists. This guy could could and should actually get an inform if you're getting f four goal contributions in a game and it's 4-0. I think you should be getting in the team of the week. Islamovic got a hat-trick for um, Deutsch Gardens, I'm sure. Um, not Deutsch Gardens, sorry, Ostersons. Why did I say Deutsch Gardens? What an idiot. Um, Ostersons and Acosta got one goal, three assists for DC United. Rooney got two goals as well, but for me, Acosta is kind of like a standout and walks into Team of the Week. I believe it was calm for what I saw and could be quite cheap and overpowered. Samata so got himself a hat trick for, uh, what is he, Genk or Club Bruges? I can never remember. Um, sure, sure, it's Genk now that I look at the badge. Then Vergard Foran got a goal and a clean sheet for Molda against Rosenborg. That was a top of the table clash. Um, so it's definitely Mold getting back into the title race with that victory. And I think that will go in Foran's favour. Then Pellegrini got one goal, one assist for Roma. You can also consider Fazio, Kolarov as well. But for me, I think Pellegrini is the strongest shout of them all and definitely deserves the inform from a Roma perspective, especially since it was against Lazio. Freddy Guarin, one goal, two assists in the Chinese Super League. Used to be OP back in the day. This could be quite a nice, cheap OP inform to enjoy. Andre Silva, two goals for Sevilla against Real Madrid. Definitely deserves an inform. If you're getting two goals against Real Madrid, I think people will stand up and take notice. 
and Finn Bogerson back in that hat trick club yet again this year. Got himself a hat trick for Augsburg, first of many, and could be even the first of many informs this year from Montefiore. Always seems to do the business. But as I say, tons of informs, potential informs to consider. You've got Dadishoff, Under, Fournals, Dembele of Leon, Kadri, Utrecht, Al Salem, De Boer, uh, Harry Kane, Paco Caster, Jadon, Sancho. Benega, so many to consider guys, but hopefully find this useful, as I said, on the top possibles as well. Smash like as always, sub to the channel if you're new, follow me on Twitter, G's on, and let me know in the comments below what you fancy, and I'll catch you all later.